from GSE Studios, the biggest game in television history, has gotten bigger. Tonight, one person can now walk away with over four million dollars. This oh. is Super Greed. And we welcome you, ladies and gentlemen, to Super Greed episode Who Knows, because I've lost track as to how many episodes we've recorded. Yeah. <laughs> We have our players at the ready, about to answer a qualifying question. The five players closest to the correct answer, high or low, will make up our team. If anybody gets the answer on the nose first, they get a $25,000 bonus. <laughs> so guys, if you're ready to go, this is your qualifying question. In weeks, how long were Jennifer Lopez and Chris Judd married? In weeks, how long were Jennifer Lopez and Chris Judd married? You're going to DM me your response. Your time starts now. Anybody gets this on the nose, I am gonna lose my shit. <laughs> By the way, I have a question. Will that twenty-five? Like... The twenty-five thousand will what? will go towards your uh, tournament total. Oh, so it's Ooh. guaranteed. Yep. Um, there's eight yeah, in. That's what I was asking. I put my answer in. Uh, okay, I got you. My answer. Oh, I got and my answer. And there we go. Oh, yeah. Okay, everybody is now locked in. Holy crap! I feel like I messed up. I feel like Same. I went a little too low. Uh, I, I know for I know for a fact one of you sure as hell messed up. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I. So it's I need to short. do. I, I just need to just do totals real All right, quick. I'm sorry. Just for clarification, you said how many weeks? Right? How many weeks? Yes. Yeah. How oh, many weeks? I thought you said days. No weeks. I thought you said oh. days. Sam? So I now we know. so now we know who fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> well, now we know who fucked. Now we know who fucked. I have ADHD. Okay. <laughs> 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 I have ADHD. You're welcome. Always listen to the question carefully. I'm doing Boy. all my. I am doing all my numbers. I messed up. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you guys, you guys will find out in due time. Maybe you don't. After Maybe you will be right later. <laughs> it'd be way too early. It'd be way too early to go into a commercial break. No, I'm. This is being recorded, so I know. So we got one, <coughs> two. Three. Kind of romances don't last that long, so I'd put a very conservative estimate. But I might nice. be very wrong. I might be much lower than that. <laughs> I had to throw a guesstimate too. And don't worry. Five. Okay. So team captain with with a guess of twenty six is Gianni. Uh oh. 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 I fucked up. I fucked uh, up. Too. Position number one goes to Aiden with twenty two. Oh, snap. Uh, position number two goes to Andy, <laughs> who guessed 69. Oh, nice. nice. Next up... Why? Next up is Logan, who guessed 70. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm not even close. And our fourth player, with a difference of 29, goes to Jamal. Oh yes! <laughs> Whoa! Funny thing wow. is, I guess, funny thing is, I guessed thirteen. Again? So the answer was forty-two. Logan, you hey. guessed oh, you guessed wow. seventy. You were twenty-eight out. Samuel guessed mm. one thousand eight hundred and fifty-seven. Yeah, because I thought it was days. Scott <laughs> guessed two hundred and twenty-two. At the end of there, but I forgot. Gabriel gets 287, Alex 185. Guys, we 30. thank you for playing, ladies and gentlemen. This is your team yeah. for Super Greed. Do you think they were married for 35 and a half years? Yeah, good luck. My god.
want the marriage to that. If you want the marriage to last that long, you better pray to God. Uh, aren't we playing for four million? Yes, we are because I get yep. to do this. Hey, there we go. Oh no. Oh no! I oh, actually no. I forgot to do a thing. I forgot to do a thing. Feels all coming from my because yeah. I didn't set I didn't set everything correctly. Shouldn't it be like? Shouldn't it be like uh, starting at fifty? Hang on, hang on, hang on! Don't let me hang on. <laughs> I'm back. What he's doing? I know what I'm doing. One, one billion. <laughs> they were married for thirty-five. <laughs> there. Oh. Okay. It's all programmed. Every team has a common phone, in which case we call it the Tower of Super Greed. We start at $25,000. We go into $25,000 increments all the way up to 100000 We double at two hundred. dollars There we go straight to a million. Double that at $2 million. Finally, $4 million. That any time a team misses a question, they lose everything. Gianni, as team captain, you get to make all the decisions. You can decide how far you want to take your team up the Tower of Super Greed. You can stop after any question, take the cash, and walk away. You have the right to reject an answer and replace it with one of your own. Simple as that. You guys ready to rock and roll? Let's roll. Yeah, yeah, let, yeah let's Good do the thing. Well. Hey, Aiden, you have the first question, $25,000. Oh, God. And if you're ready, here is your $25,000 question. Good luck. For $25,000, also a cyanotype, what is the colorful term for a set of architectural plans? Blueprints, paw prints, newsprints, fresh prints. Nani? <laughs> uh, there's, there's one thing that's coming to my mind already. I think it's like paw prints. Is that your good, is that your good to be your answer? That's gonna be my guess. Okay, Gianni, you want to accept or reject? I will reject. And replace it with? Okay. Blueprints. It says blueprints for $25,000. Oh. Right. Is it blueprints? <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, I was actually a term. I was actually a term. term. I was, term. I was <laughs> about to wait. No, Lily, I was about two seconds from <laughs> screaming at Aiden. God damn it! <laughs> it happens. It happens. Now, Gianni, everybody has five thousand dollars. Do you want to keep the cash, or do you feel the need for greed for fifty thousand dollars? We feel the need for greed. We'll keep going. And we have Andy on board. Hi. Hello. Are you nervous at all? Yes, I am. Well, let's see what happens. Fifty thousand dollars. This is your question. Okay, I need to my find my glasses. According to the Huffington Post, all but which of the following are things you can't remember anymore thanks to technology? How to give directions? How to tie your shoes? How to write a check? Or phone numbers? Uh. Oh. How to give directions, that's basically a lection when you're learning English and Czech school system. How to tie your shoes, you do that every day, there's no machine for that. Phone numbers, uh, you kind of don't remember them because you have saved them in your contacts on your phone. How to write a check. Who does that with debit and credit cards anymore? Uh, I would I would put phone numbers. He says phone numbers. Johnny, do you accept or reject? Accept. For fifty thousand dollars, is it phone numbers? No. Oh, it was tire shoes, wasn't it? It was. Oh, I knew it! I knew oh, it! I had a good feeling! So guess what, gang? We can't no, we can't end one game on just two questions. 
So we get to do another qualifying question. Oh, oh, oh my God. God. I knew it was the question. It could be any of those, really. I thought it was going to be write a check, because who writes checks these days? Well, that's yeah, the reason, I, I was that's the reason that it is uh, something you forget because of technology. How to tie your shoes, yeah. you do in your every state, everyday life. Yeah. Unless you got like those little slip ins that Skechers ha are selling these days. Because I use those for work. Those are, just, those are so shoes. comfortable. <coughs> so, now another qualifying question. Hooray! Yeah. Right. Hooray! Right. More, more hell! <laughs> Alex and Jamal. Okay, another qualifying question coming your way. Are you guys ready? No. Ready? No. Yeah. Yes. yes and. Yes. Here's your qualifying question. <laughs> yes and no. How many Mensa members? How many Mensa members are there in the United States? How many Mensa members are there in the United States? Your time starts now. Mensa members? Mensa members. Mensa members. Mensa uh, is uh, like Mensa the members. group for really clever people with the really high ideas. Yes. Oh, uh, how many are there in the U.S.? In the U.S. In U.S. Oh, probably not a lot. If they're not even mentioned, that once like you once you give an answer, it is locked in. You cannot change it. Probably a big answer. Got it. Fuck it, I don't know. <laughs> I really have, I really have, not I really have no idea. Uh, Carol Vorderman oh, is in Mensa. If any, if anybody uh, gets this answer exactly on the button. So I'll, I'll, I'll Andy, Andy, and Andy, you guys still have time. How many Mensa members are there in the United States? Andy's locked in. Yeah. You won't believe this. Charles uh, Ingram is I'm a Mensa just, member. Oh. Yeah, we're just waiting on Andy well, we if he wants number. to. So, oh my number. god. I love how we had... Apparently we Pat's had... in Mensa. Oh! I love how Pat's oh, really okay. had time for... I love how yeah, Pat's wow. really had time for one game. Proceed to... <laughs> We have time for one until y'all fucking vomit. <laughs> <laughs> well, sorry that Ty that Andy didn't know that tying your shoes was probably the most forgettable. That, that oh, was one. <laughs> There's one. Two. I was told by a, was told by a kid uh, by a teacher I'd join Mensa one day. Three, I've not tried it yet. Four. Okay, four you guys ready for this? Actual answer oh, is 56,000. Oh, 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 at twenty-five thousand four twenty, yeah. Gianni gets yeah. goes back on the team at five thousand, and with six hundred and fifty-four, Alex. Oh. Wow! Scott, that a quarter was of a million. Funny thing is, I guessed eighteen. I, I got eleven. I guess twenty-seven. And ladies and gentlemen, this is now your team for greed. But the first thing you have to do now is you have you guys have to agree on a team on a game number between zero and eighteen. And Logan, what team? Uh, what game num Game pack rather would you guys like? Uh, I'm just gonna pick a random number eleven. For eleven. Anyone want to pick eleven or? All right. You just want to go with eleven. Yeah, Legs I'm eleven. Good. We all know how it works. Ooh. Andy, you get the twenty-five thousand dollar question. Let's see if we don't bomb out. Here it is. 
Stares at on stares at Andy District Duncan. On which UK game show would you hear contestants asking for vowels and consonants? Fifteen to one, countdown, the chase, tipping point. The only one that makes sense, even though they ask for numbers, well, they add numbers to the thing as well. Countdown. It says countdown. Logan, do you accept or reject? Said that Cal Vorderman would be knocking on your door if he didn't. It's going to. It is countdown. I will accept. Twenty-five thousand dollars. Is it countdown? <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> Carol Vorderman and Rachel Riley will be at your door with gun slinging, pointed at your face. Uh, uh, Rachel Riley will be at your door too. Twenty-five thousand dollars, Logan. Do we want to keep the cash or do we want to roll it? I feel the need for greed. On, and guess I'm what? And guess what? Andy, Andy is this, is in the same position. Fifty thousand dollars. Don't get it wrong now. Second time lucky. Yeah. Here it is. If you were tickling the ivories, what musical instrument would you be playing? Saxophone, flute, piano, violin. What the actual? Are you talking about? I never heard that term. <laughs> oh. oh. Well, you know what? Uh, my family forced me to learn how to play on piano, so put piano. I I'm so sorry, I had no Logan, idea. Logan, accept or reject? Considering piano used to be made, uh, piano keys used to be made of ivory, I will accept that answer. For fifty thousand dollars and to keep the team in the game, is it oh piano? Yes, it is. Oh my god! Oh. That is exactly what it is because the keys were initially made out of real ivory. No elephant. I need to Google that ivory. Yeah. Makes sense. Everybody has ten thousand dollars. Logan, keep the cash or feel the need. Uh, first of all, I'd just like to mention no elephants were harmed during the making of these questions. Yeah. And we'll feel the need. For, we'll feel the need for speed. I mean, greed. <laughs> Seventy-five thousand. The last team captain Gianni, who really didn't have much wiggle room, now this is his redemption. Seventy-five thousand dollars. Here is your question. Do you feel the Ned for Gred? The Ned for Gred. <laughs> Which brand of soda was originally invented to pair with moonshine? Coca-Cola, Pepsi, Dr. Pepper, High C, Mountain Dew. Coca-Cola. You, you said Coca-Cola? Yeah. He says Coke, Logan, accept or reject. Uh, yeah, I'll accept that. $75,000. Is it Coca-Cola? No! What? Yeah. Believe, believe, uh, oh wow! That's that's how they oh got. My yeah, God. yeah. It was Mountain Dew. Because Coca Cola Gamer. was done by pharmacists. You Gamer's, fa Are you Gamer's favorite stress relieving drink, Mountain Dew. <laughs> oh, Coca Cola was invented to be. No, Coca Cola uh, was invented to. Uh, it was a. It was a medicinal thing. It was invented by by a doctor oh. uh, in uh, 1886. Oh yeah, I just I just remember I just remembered the video. Dr. Pepper was, Dr. Pepper was 1885, and Pepsi was originally known as Brad's Drink 1893. I I remember yeah I remember a video mentioning that Mountain Dew was mixed with moonshine or meant to pair with moonshine. Yeah. For that matter. But you know what? Let's Johnny. go ahead and just for the shits and giggles of it, let's go for a hundred thousand, Alex. Coca-Cola was mixed with coca leaf extract. Come with me and you'll see a world of your imagination. Our lyrics heard in what movie? Ghostbusters, Labyrinth, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, Grease, or Clue? Uh, what did you say? I think I'll pick Chocolate Factory the song lyrics. I'm. I could barely, could barely hear you, man. Yeah, we could barely I, hear I you. Only, I only heard what I was able to hear a stumbler. What? Huh? There's something about stumbler. Huh? 
Ow, I actually... Oh my uh, god. I actually really need to speak out. I'm he... sorry. Okay. Well, at this point, you're gonna have to take a guess. Can I make the guess for him? Because no. I'm the captain. Who's making the guess? Alex. Uh oh. He's uh he's saying Willy Wonka. Do you accept or reject? Come with me, and you'll see that I will accept your answer. One hundred thousand dollars. Nice. Is it Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory? Yes, it is. It I swear, Alex, if you had gotten that wrong, I would have been outside your house in five seconds. Right. <laughs> Every correct yeah, answer Pat has was literally. Pat was literally singing that uh, when you played yeah. the color of money. <laughs> yeah, we were literally singing that. That's where it's from. Every correct uh, question has four correct answers instead of one. You have to rely on each other to come up with those correct answers. The question is, do you want to keep the 100000 or go for 200 before you decide? Here's the category. Advance to go. Advance to go is your category. Ooh. Do you want to take the cash and run, or do you feel the need for greed? The need for greed. He's going to go for it. $200,000! Uh. That is the sound of the Terminator. He gives one person a chance to eliminate another player. Take his or her money by challenging them to a one-question showdown. Oh. They can keep the team the way it is, but to sweeten the pot, I will give the person $10,000. Win or lose. Let's activate the Terminator now. Pick me, pick me, pick Logan! Me. Yes! Pick me! The Terminator has chosen you. Is there anybody you want to call out? Take their money and their position, and I'll give you $10,000. Do I have to? You, you have the option to not. You know, Terminator, you can just shove your 10 pounds and up your ass. I'm keeping the 10. Alright. <laughs> I'm a team player. <laughs> Which I'm means we player. keep the team the way it is. Everybody now is playing for $40,000. Players, here is your $200,000 question. Which four of the following six denominations of money can be found in the standard Monopoly set? $500, $2, $20, $1, $100, $300. Logan, you have a team freebie if you wish to use it. You can, it takes away one wrong answer on any question. Do you want to use it now or save it for later? I would like to save it for later. Very well, it's best four out of six. Andy, give us a correct answer, please. Dog, oh, Bill. Hey, my guys, know that. Andy. <laughs> Twenty dollar bill. Says a hundred. Gianni. Twenty. I will say five hundred. He says five hundred. Alex, you have the last answer. He says the twenty. Now, Logan, you can choose to keep the uh, answers the way they are, or since you are too yeah, captain. Yeah, I will. I'll keep it. They're all correct. All right. $200,000. One dollar, is that a correct answer? Yes, it is. One hundred dollars. It's two down. Five hundred dollars. It's three. Logan, I can offer you $20,000 right now. No, I know it's correct. I play Monopoly on a regular basis. $200,000. Is there a $20 bill? There it is! Yeah! Whoop. Everybody has $40,000. Now the big decision please. is whether or not you want to go for one million. You have oh, a freebie. We've got it. Let's do it. Let me let, let's let just say the category before you make your decision. The category is jobs. 
Yeah, let's do it. He's gonna go for it! Oh, Arnold. Again. Another Terminator! Oh, Arnold. Let's go! Come on, land on me, land on me, land on me, land on me. <laughs> Alex! <laughs> Terminator you shows a new Alex. For the I can. Logan, can you please oh. let me do my job? Oh, sorry. Alex, is there anybody you want to challenge for $10,000, win or lose, or do you want to keep the team the way it is? And we got a strong team going for no no so I think I'll keep up. are you gonna you're gonna keep the team the way it is? I guess yet yeah. can you use the studio chat? I, it's really hard to hear you. I just yeah. All right, everybody's playing for two hundred thousand dollars. <sighs> Million dollar question, guys. Good luck. Let's get it. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, which four of the following seven professions were the highest paying in two thousand twenty-one? Physicist, airline pilot, chief executive, podiatrist, judge, dentist. Pediatrician. You guys have a freebie. Logan, would you like to use it? Considering what's at stake, I would like to use the freebie, please. Very well. Computer, take away one wrong answer, please. Takes away judge. Mm. It is now best four out of six for a million. Andy, we start with you. You know what's funny? I was going to say judge first, and now I'm relieved it's gone. Mm. Oh! Um, I'm gonna say chief executive. He's gonna say chief executive. That's one. Andy. Please don't judge me. I I was on the same boat as Andy, and we we're going to pick the judge. But my second guess guess is dentist. He's gonna say dentist. Two. Gianni. I'll say the dentist. He's going to say Batiatrist. Alex, you have the fourth and final answer of the round. I can you, I can barely use, use, use studio chat. I can barely hear you, my friend. I heard it. He said airline. Oh, he said airline. Thank you, Scott, for clarifying that. Now, Logan, as team captain. Is there anyone you want to change? I'm I'm going to change airline pilot. I no no sorry. I change podiatrist for pediatrician. Very well. But I am not sure. In all honesty. A million dollars, guys. Two hundred thousand dollars each. Chief Executive, is that a correct answer? That's one. Woo. Dentist. Oh, oh Lord. Oh, Lord. That's two. Oh. Halfway to a million dollars. Airline pilot. That's three. Oh my god. Now. Oh, the stress is real. Second, guys. I have to. I have a red case right here. I have to do this. <laughs> I, I, I have to, to make this as real as possible. I, I have to. Oh, is this real money? This right here is a hundred thousand dollars. And it's all one hundred thousand dollars. Oh boy! Do you have a bank or a safe to put that in? <laughs> if you think pe pediatrician is wrong, or you can give me my money back. 
and try to go for one million dollars. I mean... This is the answer that you did change to from Patiatrist. What do you think, guys? Risk um, it all. Or we're not allowed to confirm. Oh, well, I won't go for well, it. You guys can't confirm with the answers. Only talk about if you think you should take the money. Oh. Or go for it. Ah. Uh, why not? Very. This is stressful for me, to be honest. <laughs> what do you wish to it's do? Ultimate, it's ultimately my decision, yes. Yes, it is. I'll go for it. Okay. Sorry, guys, oh. what's wrong? He changed Podiatrist. Yes. In all honesty, I thought it was either physicist or pediatrician. For one million dollars. Is it pediatrician? <laughs> yes! Oh, you got it! One million dollars! Oh, Good my job, God. Logan. Thank you. Whoa. Good job, team. Now, oh, the benefit oh, was super great. Since you've reached the million dollar level, you guys are now guaranteed to split $200,000. It's now a matter of, do you want to now go for $2 million? Before you decide, I'm going to give you the category for your $2 million question. Category is letter please. Logan. Letter please. Letter please. Do you want to keep the million dollars or do you feel the need for greed for two million? I'm not allowed to confirm, right? You guys, are, yeah, by all means. I mean, what would you do? Do you want to save the embarrassment and take the million? I mean, you could win four, yeah, but I mean, think about it. A million dollars. Yeah. Logan, whatever oh, you do, it's your decision, but please just pay the 200 for everyone uh, for all of us. This does go towards your tournament total. Does anyone want to take no? Does anyone want to leave now? Uh, I would like to leave. To be honest, this is too much. Andy for wants me. to walk. I think Alex, Alex wants to walk. Andy. Right. Yeah. I'll have the swing there. What's the category again? Letter, Letter please. Letter, please. Letter, please. It could be anything. It could be a video game. It could be a uh, leveling Fortune. level system of anything. If, we, if, if Just a question, Pat. If we walk away, do we still see the question for shit yes. and giggles? Or? But Scott, but Scott will attempt it on his own. Oh. <laughs> Right. <laughs> if you guys don't you know want the embarrassment, leave it to me. I, I, I. This is more of a team decision than a personal decision. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna stop the game right here. One million dollars, ladies and gentlemen. Everybody walks away with two hundred thousand dollars. Nice. <laughs> and now Scott will get to play this question for one million dollars. Oh, oh boy. Good luck. No freebie. Best four out of eight. Scott, this is your million dollar question. Which four of the following eight letters of the alphabet are the most frequently used? Oh, no. S, A, O, T, N, R, E, I. Four of the eight are most frequently used. <coughs> hmm, excuse me. Um. Jesus. Um, and when you're ready to lock in answers, please let me know. I'm just kind of thinking out of it in my head. I think. A million dollar moment. 
Is it just Scott alone that wins it? It is it? just Scott alone that wins it. There's two letters I'm worried about. I will say though that if Scott gets this one correct, he will jump into the number two spot by 17,000. Well, actually, no, by, by a couple hundred thousand, because Alex just added 200,000 to his one. Oh, boy. Um. Alright, I will lock in a couple that I know for sure. Okay, go ahead. I'll, lo I'll lock in E as an effort. Okay. I'm gonna lock in... A. Lock in <coughs> S. One to go. <coughs> Jesus, I'm just trying to like look at the question because lot of letters on there, but that's only shit, that's only a very small amount of letters in English alphabet and in the English language. So I will lock in uh -huh. Let's go for T as in Thomas. Alright. They're locked in. E A S T East. Let's see how well we do. E, is that a correct answer? Yes, it's one down. A. Sport. Yes. <laughs> EA Sports, it's in the game. <laughs> EA Sports, it's in the game. How about a T? <laughs> No! no! And neither was S! R and I'm S. guessing R, R and I. I and R. Wow, I did not think I. There you Whoa. go. Neither did I. You notice your answer spelt East. The answers you went for. Yeah, that's yeah. why I went for it, but I need to go for Air, apparently. Oh, you should have went West. Yeah. There you go. Well, I'm sorry, Scott, you, left, you leave empty-handed, unfortunately. Eh, oh well, free. Oh well. Guys, that wraps up this wonderful game of Greek. Give, the, give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already. Set buttons down below. Join GSC Studios. We promise you we have cookies. Till then, it's good night and big balls. And